Hello everyone. Today I will be talking about another fragrance from Latafa, which is Latafa Wood for Glory. So how it looks, you can see Latafa Wood for Glory, Badial Wood, composition, everything, barcode. There is at the bottom, I, I guess you can't see, it is very light printing. But I will tell you it is made in April 2021 and expiring on April 2026, <coughs> 2026 so which is on five years of expiry. The box looks very soft elegant and it has a rubbery kind of texture. There is a hologram for the legitimacy and how it looks. It looks very presentable as a gift. If you want to give someone, it is very good. You don't need to pack this one. You just buy them and buy this one and give give someone as a gift. You don't need to wrap it because it is already in a beautiful packing. So I will keep the box aside. And inside the box, there is also velvet touch and the bottle kind of fits very tightly. So you see. I am holding it and it is not going to fall off. I need to squeeze it out. I need to. So this is the bottle, how it looks. You see, this, there is a logo. At the top of the cap, there is Lagafa for glory. From the sides, back side is plain. And sides is also this one. And there is metallic plate which has Latafa which has Latafa Badial Oud Audi Perfume Concentration made in UE basic details the bottle looks like a siliconic or rubber kind of texture means non-slippery it has a very good grip so all things aside we will talk about the fragrance so this one is a very unique in unique in, in terms of uh, Latafa because most of the Latafa smells similar to my nose but this one is very unique I didn't find the same smell in Latafa range so so this one is a dupe or a clone of <coughs> Initio Oud so everyone is same but uh, I never tested or tried that one but this one is very unique so I will tell you how it smells it smells kind of a burnt sugar sugar but not very thick syrupy burnt sugar there is a sugar which is just going to start burning and and you are adding some drops of uh, rose pink rose and there is saffron so uh, imagine you are burning the sugar in a pan and when the sugar just started to burn means it is not very thick or very uh, very viscous syrupy it is just started to melt and it just started to give you a burnt smell and then you added some petals or some drops of uh, pink rose and then saffron so this is a kind of uh, you can imagine this kind of fragrance like this so this is very beautiful fragrance in its own range from the top there is oud also as the name says oud for glory but the oud is not very skanky or harsh or if you wear it will not hit on someone's face it is very very settled uh, with saffron and rose so the harshness of oud is settled down by rose sugar and saffron because the oud you know most of the most of the people don't like oud so if you are even not a lover or a fan of oud you should try it because it it has oud but not very harsh or skanky oud so you can easily handle it and when to wear you can easily wear it almost uh, you can easily wear it in winter in in spring and winters i would not suggest for the summers daytime but the place where i live is a hot region and everyone like daring and loud uh, fragrances so i can for myself, I will consider it as a as an all-rounder fragrance. I can wear it at, uh, throughout the year, even day and night, and at every season. But for the other guys, I would suggest it's an evening or a um, nighttime fragrance uh, for winter and fall season. But you can try it in summer also if you are outdoors, not indoors. Maybe it will 
maybe somebody will not like it because most of the people don't like the sugary or incense kind of uh, burning smell so this has a burning smell but not uh, not burning kind uh, not the burning like latafa ragba wood intense or or fire play or back to the fireplace or something like this it has very settled kind of burning fragrance so, and so i will talk about how it lasts it last on your skin it last around 7 to 8 hours and it projects around 2 hours 2 and 1/2 hours uh, at the temperature where i am going to expose but on the cold region i i i i assume it would project around 3 and 3 and 1/2 hours so on an average you can say it is 2 and 1/2 to 3 hours projection which is very good for the price we are paying and the last thing on the skin it is around 7 to 8 hours if it is very hot outside if it is cold it may last up to 10 to 12 hours on close it lasts forever forever because i tried to spray on my shirt and i put it on laundry before putting on the washing machine i was smelling after i guess 3 or 4 days it was still smelling and on another t-shirt which was 100% cotton uh, because i believe there is some chemical reaction between the composition of the fabric and the fragrance also so the that t-shirt was 100% cotton and when i sprayed this one i washed this one even after wash i pressed i hang down on my cover after few weeks it was when i open the cover door it was the same shirt was still smelling when i open the door i was still detecting this fragrance so this is kind of very daring long lasting fragrance you can trust it but you need to try it before you buy or before you going to invest but this won't regret you i i believe this won't regret you if you are if you have any issue you won't regret it to buy the price i paid it was around 38 or 40 dollars i don't remember because i bought it last year but i i didn't make the review so it was almost around 40 year 40 40 dollars so which is very good the other one is almost 250 dollars so and this is also if you are more into fragrances and you want to try something or if you have uh, any issue with and you want to uh, get the dupe or the clone of it you can easily blend by it but for the others if you have the chance if you if it is available in your region you need to try before you buy before you invest 40 dollars in this bottle but i i i i promise it last you for ages because for a spray for myself was enough even i was i was using it at a very hot temperature in dubai so two was here one at the back side and one at the front side of the shirt it was enough for me for the whole day so and who can wear it it is i, I guess it is for all ages for for unisex also uh, i see the women the confident women can easily wear it also the airline staff the corporate staff the receptionist can easily wear it also it, it is very attractive or appealing fragrance and the men also can easily wear it on a suited or if you are going for a party if you are going for a clubbing if you are going for a dinner with friends so you can easily wear it uh, ages around 25 to 50 years of guys and girls can easily wear it <coughs> and so this one was the review for this latafa oud pro glory if you need to know anything you can ask me in the comments and i will see you in another fragrance review very soon thank you very much and stay safe